Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial on digital computer fundamentals. So in today's lecture, let us discuss about tens complement subtraction. So first and foremost, let us subtract a smaller number from larger number. So in this case, when you want to subtract a smaller number from larger number, you will find the tens complement of the subtrahend and add it to the minuend and then ignore the carry, whatever carry you get. Let's take an example. So let us try to find the result of 8 minus 2. So you are subtracting a smaller number from a bigger number. So in regular subtraction, 8 minus 2 is nothing but 6. So let us see how do we subtract these numbers using tens complement method. So what first and foremost, we need to find the tens complement of the subtrahend. In this case, subtrahend is 2. So, let's find tens complement of 2. In order to find tens complement, first you will find the nines complement of 2. Nines complement is calculated by subtracting each digit by from 9. So, 9 minus 2 is 7. And to find tens complement, you will add a 1 to it. So, I get tens complement of 2 as 8. So, this tens complement, whatever you get, you will add it with the minuend. So, 8 plus 8, you will get 16. So, here, if you get a carry, how do I say there is a carry? Because both the digits are of one digit each and the result is a two digit number. Then, this is my carry. So, I will have to ignore the carry. My final result is 6. It is matching with the actual value that is 8 minus 2 is 6. Let us try with another example a two digit number let's subtract 25 minus 12. So in this case in regular subtraction 25 minus 12 5 minus 2 is 3 and 2 minus 1 is 1. So you should get a 13 as an answer. So first what do you have to do you have to take the subtrahend and find tens complement of the subtrahend. So, in order to, because it is a two digit number, in order to find the tens complement of it, first let's find the nines complement. So, 9 minus 2 is 7 and 9 minus 1 is, sorry, 8. So, you'll get nines complement as 87. To find tens complement, I will add a 1 to it. So, you'll get tens complement of this number as 88. Let us add the tens complement with the Minuend that is uh, 25 plus 88. So we'll have to add 8 plus 5 is nothing but 13. So I'll get a carry 1. 8 plus 2 is 10. 10 plus 1 is 11. So these are two digit. Even this is a two digit number. So my answer two digit plus one extra digit is my carry. So whenever you are subtracting using tens complement, if you get a carry, you need to ignore the carry. So if I ignore the carry, my final result will be 13. Okay. So my I ignore the carry and my output is 13, which is matching with a regular, regular subtraction value. So this is how you subtract using tens complement. Uh, generally, when you subtract a smaller number from a larger number, you will get a carry. So in case you get a carry, ignore the carry. Now let's see the other way around wherein you are subtracting a larger number from a smaller number. Now when you are subtracting a larger number from smaller number, you will find tens complement of the subtrahend and add it to the minuend and then there will be no carry in this case and the result will be in tens complement form. So to get the actual result, you will have to find the tens complement of the result and you have to negate it and it will be in the negative form. So let us take an example wherein you are subtracting a larger number from a smaller number 2 minus 8 okay so uh, subtracting a larger number from a smaller number so in regular method if you subtract 2 minus 8 you should get minus 6 as the answer so in this case let's see what do we get first and foremost we have to find the tens complement of the subtrahend in this case subtrahend is 8 so, so let's find tens complement of 8 So, in order to find the tens complement, first we will find the nines complement. So, I will subtract 9 minus 8 is 1. 
with this i will add a 1 i will get 2 so my tens complement of 8 is 2 i should add the tens complement whatever you get with the minuet so in this case 2 plus 2 4 now there will be no carry in case you get a carry you will have to ignore like in the previous case but in this case you will not get a carry when you don't get the carry this answer is not the actual answer but it is the answer in the tens complement form so i'll have to find the tens complement of this let's find tens complement of 4 so i'll find nines complement first 9 minus 4 is 5 and in order to find tens complement i'll add a 1 to it the answer is 6 so here your answer is 6 that's not the final answer but you have to negate your answer so i'll apply a negation to it negative sign so this is your answer it is matching with your regular subtraction so let us take a two digit number so that you know to explain better so let me subtract 12 minus 19 so you're subtracting a smaller num uh, you're subtracting a larger number from a smaller number right 12 minus 90 so in regular method you should get a minus 7 here let's see in tens complement form how do we work on it first we will find tens complement of the subtrahend so in this case 19 in order to find the tens complement first let us let me find the nines complement of it 9 minus 9 0 and 9 minus 1 1 8 add 1 to it you will get the tens complement so tens complement of 19 is 81 i should add my first number with the tens complement you get so 2 plus 1 is 3 8 plus 1 is 9 this answer is in tens complement form to actually know the answer you have to find the tens complement of 93 so in order to find the tens complement of 93 first let us find the nines complement of 93 uh, how do we find the nines complement you will subtract each digit from 9 you can refer to my previous video on this so 9 minus 3 is 6, 9 minus 9 is 0, add 1 to it. Okay, You are adding 1 to it to get the tens complement, so you get 0, 7. Now, my answer is 7. This is not the final answer. Once you find the result, tens complement of the result, you have to negate it. So I apply a negative sign, so minus 7 is my answer. This is how you subtract or, or you subtract using tens complement method. You will get two different values. Uh, might be there are times where you are subtracting a smaller number from bigger number, or it can be a bigger number you are subtracting from smaller number. So in case you get a carry while subtraction, you will ignore the carry. If you don't get a carry, it means that the result is in tens complement form. So you have to find the tens complement of the result and apply a negative sign to it. So that's all about tens complement subtraction. If you find the video useful, kindly subscribe to the channel.